Hi guys, what's up? So I just got home from our meetup with Mr. Raymond Kadawas of Perfumes from Dubai and I finally got my December haul, which is my last haul for this year. And it consists of this one, this bad boy, Dirham, and this perfume right here. Here, so before I reveal what's inside of this box, let's roll my intro music first and let's open this package. Mabuhay from the beautiful city of Manila! I'm back with well, so for the channel Fragrance RX and today I'll be opening these two packages right here. This one and this one. So, before we begin, let's start first with this box. Now, dear Ham, now I've got, I've heard so many reviews with this one between our local, in our local fragrance community, Frag Revolution PH. I will link our Facebook group down below. Now, this bad boy here, I got this one for about eight, uh, 1,000 pesos, so that's roughly about 20 bucks, 20 US dollars. And this right here, this one, Tom Ford Noir Extreme, which I got, this is quite pricey. But again, I'll focus my opening, my unboxing video with Durham. So before I begin with Durham, I'll open this one. It's wrapped in this bubble wrap so here's my dior a uh, dior sorry tom ford tom ford noir extreme there okay so that's my tom ford noir extreme this is just a tester so it's okay i leave it there first now this is the main focus of this video dear ham i've seen the review of ify mr ify and he said that this bad boy here this dear ham smells like ref a Mwaj reflection man on the dry down and i already smelled reflection man so let's see if this dear ham is claims what it's supposed to smell like so it comes with this one this ribbon dear ham on the front of the box there it has this what's this incense i don't know it's an other parfum concentration there on the side we can see the coin like structure united arab emirates as well as here on the back it says dear ham here dear ham there dear ham eau de parfum 100 ml and the ingredients and on the bottom we can see here the barcode and i guess yeah made in uae because this is an arabic house so let's open this ribbon there we go and on the top we can see the house it says ard al zafarak ard al zafaran trading here i think that's a, that's the house ard al zafaran trading okay so without further ado let's open this box now this box comes in two sizes the one which comes with the bottle only and this one which has the deodorant perfume deodorant inside it says here there perfume deodorant inside so when we open the box you'll be the first one to see what's inside of this box there there it has also this one this official seal which is nice here Here's the inside of the box. So we have here the, the bottle and the deodorant. So here is the bottle. I'll put out the bottle first. Now, what an elegant bottle design. Here we can see the official currency of United Arab Emirates. Here, the dirham. Uh, obviously, the name itself, dirham. And the cap, it says dirham as well there dirham ard al zafaran original dirham comes with this one this this logo on the bottom we can see that it's an eau de parfum concentration there made in uae and on the back of the bottle we can see this nice design a very elegant design considering the price it's just 20 dollars and the cap is plastic made of plastic okay so for the opening spray Let's try this one. Okay, nothing on the first spray. Nothing on the second. There, on the third. Okay. Oh, mmm. Wow. 
very strong opening okay but the opening here I agree with the review of Ify that the opening doesn't contain any alcohol which surprise, surprises me the opening is really mild the opening is more natural compared to the other fragrances that I've smelled which smells synthetic on the opening this dirham smells really really natural on the initial spray now this one comes with this deodorant now I won't test the deodorant here on my underarms because <laughs> it's just inconvenient but let's try to smell what's how this deodorant smells like is it does it smell the same with this bottle let's find out now this deodorant here perfume spray dirham perfume spray oh okay let's hope that this smells good as well okay so <laughs> As expected, they both smell the same. The, the bottle itself and the deodorant. Okay, so again, the perfume itself and the deodorant, yeah, they smell the same. So, if you want a deodorant, if you want to smell, your, if, you, if you want your armpits to smell like dirham, which smells really good, then I suggest you try this one, the dirham perfume spray deodorant spray now I will have my review with this dirham and I will try to compare this one with reflection I'm watch reflection man here this is a very good very elegant bottle design guys just look at that guys even if it's just the currency the official coin of of the United Arab Emirates it's still very elegant guys guys considering the price just look how elegant this bottle is and it also comes with this deodorant and the box the box also looks good see this box really looks good so I'm hoping that this dear hamper forms well on my skin because I've been hearing reviews that this bad boy right here really really lasts long on other people's skin now as expected because of the price there's some uh, defects on the bottle but I guess this one is just on the mold here can you see it guys there but but that's nothing considering the the smell of this bad boy right here and the price that I paid paid for it I'm already satisfied with this one so that's for my unboxing and initial impressions on dirham or the perfume from the house of Ard Al Zafaran really smells good. It's a very clean scent. I can smell the rose in it. Some citrus like I think there's bergamot or lemon in this one. But it's a very fresh scent. There's no alcohol in it. Right off the bat, you can smell how natural smelling this fragrance is. And again, very citrus, very floral because of the rose. But this one is not an offensive scent. And this one is, uh, I think, I'm seeing that this one is a very versatile fragrance. You can wear, you will be able to wear this fragrance anytime, anywhere, any season. Any age group can wear this one. This is a very versatile scent. Rose, again, rose, citruses, other, and it will, I hope that this one smells like Reflection, a much Reflection Man because it's very expensive. And if you, if the, and if this one claims that this smells like Reflection Man, then I'll rather buy this one because I don't have the money to spend for Reflection Man. So that's it guys. This is my initial impressions with regards to Dirham by the house of Az Al Zafaran. I hope you like my video guys. Put your comments down below and let's talk about this fragrance. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel Fragrance RX. Again, this is Wedzo for the channel Fragrance RX, your fragrance doctor. See you in the next video. Have a nice day and stay fragrant!